Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. My name is Natalie and I would definitely love to have you here. So be sure to subscribe to my channel. In today's video, I wanted to review something super exciting. It just came out pretty recently and there's a huge hype around it and we've all heard of it. The Rare Beauty Find Comfort Body Collection. I am a huge Rare Beauty fan. I also love Selena Gomez. So many products that I love from her Rare Beauty line, like her liquid blushes, setting spray, and the bronzing sticks. I just love it all. So when I heard that she came out with a body collection, I was super excited and very intrigued to try this. So I thought, May as well do a review for you guys. The only item I was not able to get in stores, which they didn't have it at the time, the Aromatherapy Pen, which I'm pretty bummed because I really wanted to try that product. Didn't have it in the Sephora where I picked these items up, but I got three out of four of the items. So we're gonna be reviewing them. Are they worth it? What are my overall thoughts? And what do they smell like most importantly? So like I said, I got three of the four products. So I have Find Comfort Hydrating Body Lotion. I also got the hand cream and I got the body and hair mist. So super excited to try these three. I'm a huge fragrance, perfume, body mist lover. So honestly, this is the very first thing that I wanna try. So this is the Find Comfort Body and hair fragrance mist it is a super fine fragrance mist infused with biotin niacinamide and peach flower extracts to revitalize your hair and body throughout the day with a fresh addictive scent Ooh, sounds really interesting by the way i love the color choices that she made with the packaging it's just this really pretty kind of mauvey purple pink color and this body and hair mist goes for $28. I absolutely love how minimal and clean this packaging looks like to just set this on your bathroom counter it would look so aesthetic and pretty. Let's shake it up so we get all the scents activated. So as you can see it has a super fine mist which is really amazing immediately as i sprayed this into my wrist it made my skin feel super hydrated and soft sure this is infused with something to really hydrate the skin um so that is something that i really love because i don't really have that with any of my other perfumes or body mists it is a hair mist so you can just kind of spray it all over definitely smell that crisp lemon in there. So for the scent of this, it's just very fresh. It smells fresh while it's also very much on the citrus side. And that's something that I'm not really used to because typically for body mist or perfumes, I go for like a more floral scent or even a fruity scent. This kind of citrus scent I normally don't gravitate towards. However, I am falling in love with the scent. It's just so clean, it's very, comforting and calming but it's also very fresh if that makes sense and again i really love the way it makes my skin feel hydrated that is something i've never experienced with a body mist so i really love that about this you have to apply a pretty good amount because it is a body mist and not a perfume um however i do believe this will last throughout the day it just relaxes me but it also makes me feel so clean and fresh at the same time. <laughs> like, that is amazing. I love that so much. So for that reason, I would recommend this. Next product I am super excited to try because not only am I a huge body mist and perfume fan, but I also really love body lotions and staying hydrated. So this is the Fine Comfort Hydrating Body Lotion. Honestly, a huge fan of packaging. So when I saw this, I was like, wow, that is really pretty for a body lotion. It is a lightweight nutrient infused body lotion that absorbs quickly to hydrate nourish and soften with a fresh non-greasy feel all while visibly revitalizing skin with a healthy glow hands definitely need some lotion especially during the winter time they get so dry it's really bad so <laughs> immediately as i'm putting this on it feels like almost a water-based lotion, if that makes sense. It's very lightweight, like it says. I had to find the fragrance notes on this lotion. So it says it is lemon zest, rhubarb, and pomelo. 
And then it also has jasmine petals, violet black tea extract, nivir, I don't know if I'm saying that right, probably not. Um, and then tonka beans and cashmere wood. There's two things that can definitely smell this lotion. I can smell the lemon citrusy scent and I can also smell that undertone of cashmere and kind of like this warm scent to it. I believe the scent is actually stronger on the body lotion than the body mist. So if you love a nice fragrant lotion, this is definitely going to do it for you. Again, something about it just has that aromatherapy calming feel to it, but it still smells really fresh and beautiful. It really did a good job at hydrating my skin. It did not give me a greasy feel at all, which is definitely a plus. And I would say in terms of hydration, this is at about a medium level. It's not too thick and hydrating and just super moisturizing. It's also not too lightweight where it barely gives you any hydration. I would say it's just about at the medium level, which is perfect for every day. This is a little bit more on the pricey side at $28 for a body lotion. If you're looking to splurge on a lotion, I would definitely say this is the one. It's just, it has a very luxe smell to it. The way it feels really impresses me and the scent is very lovely. So if you want to splurge and treat yourself to a really nice body lotion, I would say this is worth it. Okay, and lastly, we have the Fine Comfort Hydrating Hand Cream. I am so excited to try this because the one thing about me is that I will always have a hand cream in my purse or in my car because again, my hands are always super dry. I love a good hand cream, so I'm super excited to try this. This one says it is a lightweight, fast absorbing hand cream infused with niacinamide, ashwagandha, extract and peach flower extract to hydrate nourish and soften skin with a fresh non-greasy feel this hand cream goes for $18 and let's see how it looks Again, I am a huge sucker for packaging, so when I saw this, I thought it was literally the cutest thing. This would definitely fit in one of my Lululemon belt bags, which is chef's kiss. To open this one, you literally just turn the nozzle and boom, there you go. So it smells really good. Again, it has that same kind of citrusy, lemon, cashmere scent to it it's very very nice i love the scent right away this is super hydrating on my hands i do notice that this one has even more hydration than the body lotion which is definitely a plus and with the size of this i do love how you could just pop it in your purse or your car do i think that this is superior to other hand creams i've tried Probably not, but it's still really nice. Overall, I enjoy this hand cream. I do think that the other products are more worth your splurge than this product. I probably wouldn't recommend this one over the body mist or the lotion, but this is still nice, but I probably just wouldn't repurchase this. So overall, with the Rare Beauty Fine Comfort line, I really enjoy these products. That these products have a very unique and lovely scent that I can't really think or find anywhere else. Three of these just do a really great job at hydrating my skin and making me feel relaxed while also feeling fresh, which is just something that I've never experienced and I love so much. Love this mauve purple pink color in the packaging. I think it's so pretty. If you're going to try these products, top two picks would definitely be the hair and body mist and the body lotion. I love the citrus fresh scent that both of these have and I just think that these two products would pair really well together. So yeah, out of the whole line, I would definitely recommend these two. If you have the aromatherapy pen, comment below if you've tried it and what you think about it. Be sure to comment below if you have tried this line and if you have, what are your favorite products? If you're planning to purchase these, which products are you planning on getting? I'm also really excited to see what she comes out with in the future. I'm thinking she might come out with some skincare or a hair care line perhaps. Now, with that being said, thank you again so much for watching this review be sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys soon in the next video bye